so excited today because I'm going to announce the winner of the Coded 2 giveaway from last week. But that's going to be at the end of the video. Right now, let's focus on the bunch of junk I just uploaded to YouTube. I've been thinking about the plethora of CSS grids that are available to us, and I've been wanting to talk about them for a long time. And I never really found the right angle, but I've got something for you today. I think I figured it out. So I found this website layout wireframe in some dark corner of the internet, and I thought, hmm, wouldn't it be interesting if I recreated this layout again and again using different frameworks? This would be really cool because we'd be able to see the different methodologies that each framework espouses to get the same job done. Another reason I'm excited about this series is because each installment is piecemeal. You can pick and choose what you want to see, what frameworks you want to look at, and which ones you don't. And what's also cool for me about this is because it's an open-ended series, there's no obligation for me to do them all in order or even all at once. So today I did one, and then next month, you know, I'll maybe come back and do another one or when, or when I feel like it's a good time. So this video turned out to be long, very long in fact, so I tried to do something new for Dev Tips for this first time I've cut a video into multiple pieces. Now I recorded it all in one sitting, but it's in a lot of different parts so you can take a break and go get a corn dog or whatever. Now if you guys watch this in the playlist view, I'll be cutting off the intros and the outros to make it easier for you guys to get to the juicy stuff. What's that, you already thought of that? This is the playlist view? Well, aren't you a clever girl? So today is the first day in this unordered series. <laughs> I love these. <laughs> and what better way to kick off this series by looking at the most popular kid in school, of course, Bootstrap. Now I do think it's a really good idea to take a look at the Bootstrap grid to dissect the CSS that, in, that actually makes the CSS grid, but today is not that day. We're just gonna use it to make a layout and see how easy it is to use. I like this, I'm excited, and I'm sure that these videos will become more valuable as other frameworks are added to the series. And now, the moment we've all been waiting for, I'm going to announce the winner of Coda 2. Now this is a $100 piece of software, it's not like a cheap piece of software. <laughs> It's made by a company called Panic, who also make other cool things, and I talk about the features at length in last week's video. Go check that out if you haven't seen it yet. To be eligible for this giveaway, I asked you to tweet a link of the video and the hashtag #DevTipsGiveaway. Now my videos usually average about seven tweets. <laughs> That's not huge, right? But this video, I'm excited to say that it gathered 137 tweets in total just about the video. So thank you so much. I really should give away other people's software more often. <laughs> now this tweet is picked completely at random. It belongs to Frizzly Velasquez from Guatemala City, Guatemala. All right, happy early birthday. <laughs> awesome, thank you so much. And before we close, be sure to check out the secret link in the description below, it is a good one. And the DevTips question of the week, well it's more of a poll really, but I'd like you guys to vote on the CSS framework that gets featured next in this series. To be clear, I'm not going to pick the framework that's mentioned the most times, I'm going to pick the framework that is in the comment with the most likes. So if you see somebody else has already mentioned the framework that you want to see in the next uh, installment of this series, just go ahead and thumbs up their comment. I know that I'll be thumbs upping the one that I want to see next, but ultimately, it's up to you. Be sure to subscribe to Dev Tips to be notified when the next video in this series comes out. And to close the show, we have Harry from San Francisco. Uh, hey, what's up? My name's Harry uh, from San Francisco, California. Uh, well, uh, thanks for watching Dev Tips. Keep on hacking.